We're here today to create a celebratory cheesecake to mark Christie's 250th anniversary. The recipe itself is inspired by one that was used back in the late 18th century, but we've given it a contemporary twist. I'm just going to prepare my biscuit base. So I'm just beating the biscuits with a gavel to play on the Christie's Auction House reference. The only problem with bashing your biscuits with a gavel is that you become a Christie's auction. Just to save on the washing up, I am going to mix up the broken biscuits in the actual pan. And what's lovely is that the chocolate melts from the heat of the butter, so you end up with a chocolatey buttery biscuit base. We're using chocolate covered digestives to play on the fact that chocolate was a luxury back then. I'm then going to just take my 25 centimetre tin and I'm just going to transfer the buttery mixture. And then with the back of the spoon, you just want to press it all down, creating an even level surface. And then you just want to chill that in the fridge until it's completely set. I'm sieving some of it just into a bowl and then transferring some of the mascarpone. And then I've got two 25 mils of vanilla extract. Halfway through, we're just going to stud it with 250 grams. See, there's a pack of here with some raspberries. And then I'm just going to cover the top with the freeze dried raspberries. Arts and crafts in the kitchen. This cheesecake represents 250 years of history, so it's worth spending a little bit of time to make it look perfect. So there you have it, 250 years of history in one delicious cheesecake. Happy birthday, Christine.